Pretty good. Welcome back to the Tidball Taste Tour, another edition of the fine show that we... It's a pretty good show, I like it. putting out for I you. I watch it. Yeah, well I know you do. I don't. Um, You're our number one fan. I'm actually clicking on all of them. <laughs> I don't. When I have to sit through one, it's painful. Uh, what what a, we got this time? What a terrible program we have. Well, what we have this time, the Krabby's from Edinburgh. Krabby's Spiced Orange Alcoholic Ginger Beer. 4.8% alcohol by volume. Uh, started in Edinburgh, Scotland in 1801. Currently produced and bottled by Halewood International, United Kingdom. Blah, blah, blah. Let's drink it. 12 ounces in there, 11.2. 11.2. 11 11 well, see, there's your difference. That's no good then. I, I feel very cheated out of the, the extra .8 ounce. Right. See, now I don't know how much to pour. Well, right, because it's they, get, they don't have that extra point .8. Yeah. It's a little confusing. Keep talking. <laughs> you talk. <laughs> I've been really talking the whole time. You talk. Somebody else talk. Okay, well... Um, if you don't know the origin of Krabby, it's, uh, yeah, he got Krabby. <laughs> Some guy in Edinburgh got Krabby. <laughs> and, wow. uh, this made him feel better about it. <laughs> There's the oh, Daniel boy. fun fact for the episodes. <laughs> I think that's really good. <laughs> I'm joking a little. I don't taste as much orange as I thought I did. No, not a ton. I, I like that. that. And I like that this, more than the original, has, feels like it has less ginger. Like it's not yeah, it's as, a little sweeter. It's not as overpowering on the ginger. I, I, I like this better. It's orange, but it's definitely like I sweeter. Like this. See, I think that that has to do with it though, is because yeah. any flavor mixed with ginger is going to be really hard to taste because ginger is just so, so overpowering. Yeah. True. But there is definitely a sweet citrusy aspect of it yes. that, while muted because of the ginger, you, it's there. Yeah. Um, it's not I, as offensive as the first one. I felt like yeah. the other one was really harsh. Yeah. This one I feel like more drinkable. I agree with that. Not, not only more drinkable, super easy to drink. Yes. Uh, I really like it. Um, I don't remember what I rated the first one. Um, but, uh, Man, I would say for this, probably about a... Oh, man. This is a little bit tough, actually. Yeah, I don't like that I don't remember what I gave the last That's one, actually. Too, yeah. I don't either, and um, I'm going to rate this an 8.0 because I do think it's good, and I think it's very easily drinkable. Slight citrusy sweetness. Uh, just a, a nice ginger flavor, G certainly gingery, as all ginger beers are, but not uh, not over, not real overpowering. Uh, yeah, eight point zero. Have you noticed companies that make alcohol? Many of them seem to love elephants. Yeah. Have you noticed this trend? Yeah. What is this about? Don't know. They love elephants, elephants or that are or like big creatures like the rhino and. Yeah. What is it about those creatures that? Could be that they like booze. Well, I don't think so. <laughs> Maybe they do. Maybe they have some, Yeah, drink some, some booze. I don't know. Maybe. I mean, it would take a lot to make them drunk, so why not? Well, if this if a four-pack of this was $10, it would probably cost them, mm, I don't know, 300 to even get a buzz. Yeah. Um, I'd like to give this a... a 7. I think it's pretty good. I'm gonna match you on a 7 there. Tasty. I think it's worth checking out. I wish I knew to you. what I... I don't remember what I gave you If someone has seen the other one, and I did give well, it a better rating, then don't disregard it. I like this one better. <laughs> Actually, yeah, I would agree with that. I would prefer this one dinner. I would, too. Uh, I know. I, I kind of taste the much. orange more on the aftertaste. Like, I kind of taste orange now. Really? Mm-hmm. I smell orange, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, so... Um, I mean, it's, it's, it's there in the taste, it's just not that much. It's not just, like... Orangey Yeah, it's not it's orange. Like... It's not orange soda alcohol. Yeah, orange exactly. Soda. No. It's not no. orange soda with a, it should be with a little bit of like ginger like in it, or a little bit of ginger in it. Yeah. Oh, wait. 
For more than 200 years, Krabby's has shipped its ginger from the Far East, following in the pioneering footsteps of the first Scots merchant traders, hence our distinctive elephant trademark. Ah. Yep. Following a secret recipe, it, the steeped ginger is matured for eight weeks. It's then combined with real orange extract, giving it a, a deliciously distinctive flavor. So, two sevens and eight. Uh, that would put the rating in the low to mid seven range. Check out the Krabby's Spiced Orange Alcoholic Ginger Beer. Particularly good if you have Krabby's, apparently. So, uh, makes you feel better about makes it. Makes you feel a little better about your Krabby's. You won't be as crabby about it. <laughs> be as crabby about your Krabby's. The Taste Store will be back. Thanks for joining us.